Hi, I'm Sam, and today I'm going to go over in, in making a homemade grip for your AR handle. Uh, if most of you guys out there have a uh, AR-15 of some sort, and it comes with a real skinny uh, hand grip, and you really can't afford to buy a fatter grip, what you can do is, is what I did right here. I just took a uh, old inner tube, which is right here, and I cut them to about one inch each piece. Took off the uh, the trigger guard uh, lower piece here. Just hit the snap and bring it down. And you just keep wrapping it up until it feels comfortable around your grip. Um, if those of you have bigger hands and you have a tendency to grip your uh, the grip, you can end up over gripping and it's hard to get to your trigger if you go to the range. That's pretty much the only way you can find out is when, if you actually shoot it. Also, you know, just doing dry runs too, but it feels much better and it doesn't affect your grip at all on uh, slipping. It actually feels better than the actual checkering that's on the, uh, the, the grip itself because it is rubber. Uh, but it feels good. You just put a bunch of layers on until it feels comfortable for you. And that, that will save you a, a ton of money. Uh, I know grips cost about 60 to $100. Uh, if you can't afford that, this cost me absolutely nothing. As I was out uh, just walking my dog in the woods, there you go. I find a, uh, a beat-up bike just sitting there. I cut the tire off, took the tube. This cost me absolutely nothing. Uh, that's that's the good thing about looking for resources even uh, Just walking around just look for resources. That's just what I do You don't have to wait for an apocalypse and all that bullshit like everybody says you just go out And keep your eyes open and you never know what you can find All right, uh, this uh, that's all I have to say um, I'm Sam and thanks for watching and subscribe and have a nice day